Hello everybody, Frame Loss here again with another build in Mother Gunship. Today we are looking at the Zipper. Look at this. Look at this beautiful jet engine piece of machinery. I'm going to teach you how to build this, but first, let's show it off. Let's show it off just a little bit. We've got two chain guns, a shotgun, two uh, ricochet, and two jet engines on this thing. This is going to be bringing a lot of boost into the picture, so let's just see it real quick in action before, before I show you how to build it. What you're going to notice is movement is through the roof. You're going to get a lot of mobility out of this gun. And the damage is pretty good. For the energy consumption, the damage is pretty good for this. This would be a great secondary gun to have while your other gun on your right arm is doing more of the DPS. This is a great gun to have for mobility and just staying alive. So let's show you how to build it. So first, we're going to remove everything. Start from scratch. Okay, what you're going to start with is the triangle connector. And you're going to want to turn that so the top is facing up. Next, the three box. Make sure that is pointed up. This this way, it doesn't really matter. As long as one of these is pointing up, it doesn't matter. You're losing one space on this, but that's okay. Next, we're going to put on the two side connector right on top of that. And then this is where your jet engines are going to go. You're going to turn those facing the back. And there we have, like, the main... The main part of the weapon is, is is now made. Now, we're gonna add the two connectors down here. And then on these ends, this is where we're gonna add our ricochet. You can face these whatever way you like. I like them facing out. Then down here, we'll add our chain gun barrels. And then right smack in the center, that's where we're gonna put our shotgun. Now, I like the crosshairs facing up so it looks like you're... The iron sights facing up so it looks like you're looking down them. And that's... There you have it. It's an easy gun to make. It's expensive in the demo, at least, because these jet engines are 12 apiece. So you're going to have to collect at least 24 coins just to make this. Um, and then the shotgun and then the two... Uh, well, you only need one to buy one repeater. But the jet engines are going to come at a price, so be wary of that. Now let's go to the last level and show off that just a bit, just so you can see the mobility around in an actual stage. We're looking at 462 damage, 35 uh, shots a second. The f energy is at 50, so it's pretty low for a gun like this. And I'll show you how it performs in the final stage. I like it because it makes the game crazy fast, and I can see stages where that's going to be very nice to have. So if you just feather the trigger, you've got a lot of map traversal, as you can see. You can just get around this map. Now, you can replace the shotguns with anything. Uh, I went with shotguns just to get... Just to get something a little different in here. It takes some getting used to because of the speed. But if you've played Quake before, you should be right at home. When you are new to this gun, make sure you're holding back just so you're you're not jetting around all over the place when you don't want to be. As you can see, it'll move you forward if you're just holding it. But there you have it. That is the zipper. This is from Frame Lost Studios. It's a nice little gun. It really adds a lot of traversal to a game that already has a lot. And as you can see, yeah, the four jump is nice. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will be making more of these build videos, so please like and subscribe. And I will see you next time with another build from Frame Loss. Oh, my God.